How you doing, Libra? So this will be your September 2022 love reading. Now, Libra, we got transformation, reversed hope, and then we got deception and envy for your overall three cards. Now, I feel like there may have been an ending between you and someone, but I feel like you decided to let this person back in. You decided to let this person back in, and I feel like even though you let this person back in and this person didn't change, I just feel like you was holding on to this person because you still love this person. But I feel like you may have found out about something about them, Libra. And someone could have came to you and told you this. Or it could have been like a mom, a dad, or a cousin. Or it also could have been like a healer or a tarot card reader. But basically your person got exposed. Something came out out of the open. And... I feel like your person may have deceived you. Your person may have lied, stole, cheated, did whatever they did that was deceptive towards you that you have found out about after you took this person back. And whatever it was, I just felt like it left you heartbroken with this three of swords right here. It did. It felt You felt really stuck, really confused about where your relationship was going to go from there after you found out what this person has done to you, Libra. Some of you guys were so hurt to the point you could barely get out of bed. You may have been having a hard time even focusing on your daily tasks, maybe even going to work, you know, or just focusing at work, period, you know, because of this devastating news that you found out about your person. And I just felt like you just was very hurt and very confused about it, you know, because you didn't know if your person was with somebody else or not. Some of y'all felt like maybe some of y'all found out your person went back to somebody from the past you know you thought y'all was gonna start all over again and be together but your person may have went back to somebody from their past and may have left you hanging but i am seeing that somebody ready to move on somebody your person i feel like this is your person energy your person may have snuck away I, f I really feel like your person snuck away from you or you may have snuck away y'all after you found out this news but I just felt like you have been overly obsessing in your head about what it is that your person has done to you even though they left or even though you left I just feel like you having a hard time actually getting getting it over it because we got the eight of swords reversed and then we got the two of swords so you still can't get it out of your head about what this person has done to you because you was confused you was you know you didn't know why would, you know, you could have told yourself, I don't know why my person would do such a thing. Like, you know, we, I thought we were starting all over. I thought we would start a new beginning, but your person then turned around and did some, uh, some sneaky shit behind your back, which devastated you, you know, cause I'm clearly seeing that your person may have been going back and forth between you and another person. It could be somebody that they have children with Leah, Libra, but I am seeing that. Some of y'all trying to make y'all still trying to make a decision or you could just be thinking about making a decision about whether you should keep this person in your life or whether you should continue to leave this person alone. Y'all take me resonate. But I just feel like for the most part, this energy is where your person had two people or just other people. I'm getting two people back and forth between you and another person from their past with the six of cups reversed. And it's because your person didn't care. Your person didn't care. They wasn't trying to make change with this death card reverse. They knew they wasn't going to make change once they came back in your life. And they knew they really haven't had anything to give you in this relationship from the jump. You know, I feel like you was looking for a solid new beginning with this person, looking for a commitment, looking for things to get better in your relationship. But your person had other plans. Your person may have been dealing with that other person the whole time. Even though you took them back, I feel like your person, some of y'all already knew this person was dealing with that third party still but maybe you found out some more news which really hurt you you see what i'm saying and you just have a hard time you know getting over it yeah somebody's being dropped somebody's being left behind because they feel like they can have better y'all definitely letting go of this person i feel like this is y'all energy y'all letting go of this person because this person is just too much of a burden in your life and you're looking for somebody that's going to make you better you know, you're looking for progression. You're looking for movement. You're looking for things to get better. Maybe you look for somebody who can help you just as much as that you can help them. You know, I just feel like you just want to be at peace. You just want to get grounded. You want to 
you know, get back to being yourself. Because some of y'all have not even been yourself going back and forth with this person. Y'all just have not been yourself. And um, I just feel like for the most part, Libra, Libra y'all energy is showing me that y'all leaving this person alone. Y'all leaving the burden behind. Y'all moving forward to bigger and better things. You, some of y'all focusing on y'all health. Maybe y'all health was out of alignment when you was dealing with this person. Maybe you gained weight. Maybe you lost weight. Whatever the case may be, I'm seeing you bounce back from everything that you were struggling when you was dealing with this person and rebuilding your life back up again. Some of y'all may have even had to move house after this person left you. I am getting that. And ju um, justice reverse. Yeah, this person did you wrong. This person treated you really unfair. They may have left you and went back to, I'm hearing a toxic situation. But your person going to get bad karma for what they did to you. You will recover for whatever it is that you've been struggling with. Your person, even on it's crazy because I feel like they're going to come back once they realize they they misjudged you. Once they realize they they did you wrong or whatever. I feel like it's for the most part is once they realize that they got bad karma or they're getting bad karma, then they want to come out. Then they want to come back. They want to come back. Look, the empress. To start a new beginning because you got your shit together. I told you, you going to bigger and better things. And your person, look, they coming back because they see you bounce back after they left. Look, didn't I say that? The emperor. Some of y'all could be dealing with an Aries. Some of y'all could be dealing with a Taurus or another Libra. But I'm seeing a lot of air also, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, or it could be Aries, like I said. Those are the energies that I'm getting. But your person do want to start over. You know, and it's crazy, like, it's like once you do all of this stuff to get back in alignment, once you lose weight or once you gain weight, whatever it is that you're trying to get back to yourself when it comes to your health, once you level up when you're, with, with your work situation, some of y'all even started a business by the time this person come back. Some of y'all even got a really better paying job, a better house, you know, some of y'all going to have a relationship with somebody else by the time this person come back. This is the empress and the emperor. Some of y'all, this person going to want to be with you again. They going to want to start all over with you after they left you for like the third, fourth time. Yeah, you're not hooked on this person like you used to, Libra. You're not. But that person, they can't let go of you. They may try to use sex to come back in if you're not in a relationship by the time this person come back in. I told you this person is under judgment. That's the only reason why they want to come back because they're facing karma right now. That's the only reason why they want to come back in. They want another. I don't feel like it's a second chance. I feel this is like three or four chances. Yeah, they want to recover whatever has happened between y'all. They want to, you know, get back with you. They tired of being away from you, thinking about you. You know, they want to come back. But I feel like it will be another waste of time. It will. Because it's going to be another triangulation. It's going to be another unhappiness. You're not going to be satisfied. They're still going to be keeping things from you, and you're going to be in regret and heartbreak all over again. This is another disappointment, Libra. Look, bang. Didn't I just say that? The emperor. It will be another disappointment if you let this person back in. It will be another tower moment. It will be you losing your house again or having to move or, or you may end up catching this person doing something. I'm hearing that it's going to get worse if you let this person come back. That's the energy that I'm really picking on. So this is up to you, Libra, whether you want to let this person back in or not. Some of y'all's energy has already passed, but if it resonates, don't forget to like, comment down below, and subscribe if you have not subscribed, and I appreciate you guys. Y'all be blessed, Libras.